you know, right back into it. Um, nice and fresh. Speaking of fresh, I think that Venya will come to this. He's got that fresh breath of air, and he has a lot of Palak Svena experience at this point. I need to see this, because uh, low profile. Definitely mess with Palak in this matchup. Yep. Look at that. Yes, Fair exactly right, right there. <laughs> and then he's put in the mix. Exactly. That was really interesting how he did that with uh, up tilt, but that makes a lot of sense because oh, he, he just low stood there. He's that. like, "You're gonna do a fair. Yeah, I'm yeah. just gonna do nothing." Is that up tilt disjointed at the tongue? Because that would be really strong if it is. I've never actually thought about that. It's actually. I feel like it's a pretty honest hitbox. He's just dead. Like it's not too disjointed. Yes. That would be kind of silly if a tongue he went just... for auto reticle there. Like, <laughs> scary. Yeah. This matchup scares me a lot. <laughs> it, it's it's a very fast one. Palatina is gifted with quite a good mobility, quite good hitboxes and stuff like that, but she's not the best in any of those categories by far. So when she comes up against someone who's very fast, <laughs> like Greninja, who just happens to be a little bit faster and whose hitboxes and her boxes, like you said, pancake and the counter here. He had, oh my god, he's going ham on he this. Had, he had time to like set up for the potential jab lock and still punish the tech away with dash <laughs> attack. Like, Greninja's nuts. Absolutely. Greninja frame traps your tech situations on the ground. Like, what is Oh, what is hard read on his roll away. Nice. Scary situation, good counter. Yeah. These, these counters, like, kind of unethical, but, like, they seem necessary. Yeah. He he, just, he's like, all right, you're going to try and hit me here. He's getting smothered right Another now. Another down so fair. How far are we into this game? A minute and a half? It feels like I've been yeah. 30 seconds. Like, we've been watching. Because yeah, these, these guys haven't stopped moving yet, you know? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. There has not. not been a dull moment. And that's the thing, too. Uh, Greninja's whiffs as well, also low profile and very difficult to punish. So, like, down tilt like that? How are you going to punish that with an arrow? You're going to hit that with falling there? No, he'll do something else. He goes under you. He slinks away. He's got the Missing counter. That He's got here. enough Not of recovery mix up. All right. Gets him in the mix, but doesn't get him with the frame trap off of anything off of uh, up there. That felt like it should have been a punish situation in there. Ninja Mad Nice on, like, Halo's shield. All right. He's like, oh, I'm in an air shield, and you better not press a button. Yes. I'm surprised he didn't go for the punish uh, off of the air dodge there. That was definitely a punish scenario, but maybe just thought he wouldn't make it in time. I love that. I love that there just combos into that kind of thing. <laughs> yeah. It's like it's not her best combo starter, but it, it's good. Yeah, it, it, it's nice having the flexibility to be like, I want to use this move now. I want to combo out of this. Like I said, Palutena, a very like complete feeling character, even if she's not the absolute best at anything. She's All of very her moves solid. have a purpose. Exactly. She's not like, it doesn't feel like, oh, this move just exists. Except for Jab. They wreck Jab. Uh, jab I, used to be sick. How so? And what changed about it? I used to be able to, oh my god. <laughs> used to be able to combo uh, grab into it. Oh. Out of it. Well, that was uh, a universal change, I think. Yeah, but like, it was just better. It's the same frame, but like, uh, oh my god, that almost worked. Still what? Palu having Jab grab in this game would suck. Kind of for everyone. Like, yes. Imagine getting jab grab at the ledge. Yeah, like, imagine imagine just people being, would be crying. Just imagine That's getting scary. mixed up out of jab. I mean there's still people with jab combos, but it's definitely a lot more laid back compared to before. Uh these from reflect to get him back on the stage, relieve the pressure. He's been doing uh, a little bit of that running in there. He's like, oh, I'll challenge these. I'll put some. Hey, how's Benny gonna land? Uh, this is still him. very doable. I think this is very doable. It's it not is. It's just scary. Yes. He's he's uh he's in that down tilt percent range where like down tilt fair might hit, uh, and it doesn't have to hit because he just frame trapped it into down smash. So the man was it's standing. Tough. The man was standing in a five lane highway, hoping not to get hit by traffic. He had to like I don't know air dodge the platform and probably Vinny didn't cover that. Like yeah. well, I mean even at that percent, it seems like Greninja still has enough. Uh, I guess I would call it a frame trap or a 50-50. I'm not entirely sure because I don't know his, his data very well. But enough pressure that... It was a frame trap because he air dodged. Because mm -hmm. if he didn't air dodge, he would have, like, you know, got hit. And, you know, and he doesn't if he did, he was getting hit by the down smash. At least the way he air dodged. And he doesn't have many options besides that. As we've seen, uh, he can be beaten out. Not always, but fairly consistently. Uh, if Venny follows up with another move, counter probably would have just been a straight whiff at that point and Venny could have reacted. It's a tough situation to get out of when you're behind like that. Okay, goes for the auto reticle. Auto reticle and explosive flame are interesting tools. I think they're all right, um, but in this matchup, using them at all in neutral like this seems like you're asking to get punished, even if you're like going off of a read. 
Uh, yeah, Greninja is so fast and he goes so low that like, I don't know, if you auto reticle, he can actually kind of like run under it. But uh, it's still good, it makes them approach. Um, yeah, Explosive Flame, not good in neutral because no. Greninja will just run right through you yeah. and like, or run right up to you and, and you will get punished. Both Explosive Flame and Auto Reticle. Like guard, Auto trap. Reticle a little better because it follows, but both of them punishable like a traditional uh, 2D Fireball. Like if you jump over it, if you get around it somehow, that is a straight punish for you. Yeah. Oh, catches uh, the Teleport. Catches, yeah, it catches the start up there. Yeah. Very good stuff. That is honestly very good. It can be quite difficult at times to catch Palutena when she's warming. I respect that bear right there. He almost had that. All right. Tries to go for a hard read on that. Wants to close up the stock, but isn't going to get it that quick. Venya, Venya just doesn't play too crazy. You know, he plays like he's all over the place. Don't get me wrong, but it's not like, yo, let me throw out my wackiest hitbox and hope I get the kill. He's like Except very... that one. He's just like, ready, ready. I want to see. Is it dash attack time? No, it's yeah. fair time. <laughs> oh. Water shuriken. Fairly safe recovery. And uh, same as before, not seeing a whole lot of edge guarding here, but probably doesn't want to get put off stage against Venya, which I don't play for at all. It's difficult working back to neutral from. I mean, it's hard. Like, you can go for like the fair ledge guard. Um, but Venya is really aware of that. All right. I've told a bit of a slow option out of the teleport there, but definitely works out for <laughs> All right, Dunton Presser does get him with the neutral jump into the nair. Ooh. Oh, not down so fair. All right, Lenny with nair is a smart right. call there, actually. Allen on ledge. Ooh, coming up with that fair. Risky, because if they hit you, you don't have a jump, but uh, it's definitely something you kind of got to mix in there. Not quite. That was good, yeah. He's hanging on. Ooh. Oh, no, he gets above yeah. the water. Then you're not really waiting with the uh, the water right there. If he waited a little bit more, he probably would have got that. It was absolutely the right idea, just slightly this time. Oh yeah, definitely. Ooh, ooh, drag down, regrab. Okay. All right, that's him in the mix. He does get back on the stage. All right, back to neutral. This honestly isn't a bad spot. I thought uh, Jen a couple times there was gonna lose the stock, be down, but he's, he's at he's least doing a really good job credit. at like keeping center stage. Absolutely. That seems like a really big deal on this one. Like, especially this percent Greninja, I don't think can really carry you too much off stage. It's big in this game. Is up there gonna kill? Yeah. Alright, no problem. 87 That's strong. is a very It's like, cool. oh, my kill confirms don't work anymore. <laughs> Let me grab. grab. Absolutely. Uh, and then I think most grabs right now are Mix. very like what's the word? They they've Generally got the same startup, yeah. Like all grabs are pretty, uh, all grabs are pretty fast now. Or am I imagining that? Is that something else? Um, yeah, I think like all regular grabs do. Because I know they have it, different distances. Yes, I know it's not universal because like I play Zelda and she's like maybe slightly disjointed on her grab, but it's 11 frame startup. But I think most grabs are like frame six or something right now. I could be very wrong about that though. Good drag down there. So 55. Yeah, chase him low didn't really leave him with many options. Ooh, it's gonna be another uh -oh. Nair. Nair train doesn't get the mix up afterwards. Platform does save him even without a tech. Very even. Alright. This was good. I was gonna say previously, if Benny wants to camp this out a little bit, uh, it might be a hard time for Jen. But it's looking like he's making really good work so far. Alright. Not gonna kill. That's good. Okay. Ooh. I'm surprised he didn't just go for the F smash there. Could have maybe been a miss input. Uh, yeah, he had, he had a lot of time jab. to think about it, but I, I think like you know, uh, going for down tilt is so ingrained there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then uh, of course, uh, jump out of shield aerials not suffering the same. Whoa, yeah, nice. that was. Yeah. He, he knew. Uh, <laughs> Benya does not look happy. <laughs> then he was dashing back and forth a lot. He <laughs> definitely caught the dash start up there. Oh my god, I would be upset too. To be fair. I would be, I would be mad. It was, it was good patience from uh, Alan. He, he was definitely like very aware of like. What? <laughs> yeah, it was really far away. <laughs> that's what we were talking about. Look, yeah. he, you can see him stick out. I think that's dash attack. He stuck it, out it, dash it attack. It hit him that far away, but like he was definitely getting look, hit look, by look, that look, look, no look, matter what. Here, like, look, look at it. Look at this happen. He's, he's there. 
Look, he sticks out his foot. Oh, yeah. It clips the dash it. attack, that's what it is. Unfortunately, in this game, if anything hits any part of your body, you get full damage. So stuff like that happens. When you counter poke, and he put it all on that counter poke, you get crazy stuff like that. Yeah. And he got away with it. Honestly, that was very that's respectable. He, he just kind of like, I don't know, kept center stage, pushed him to the ledge, like, got him to make a bad decision. So let's assume, for example, I know that we've got uh, game three going on. But let's assume, for example, that that is whiff. That was more or less game, unless Venya messes up his punish. I would say. So the fact that oh, he what? goes for that, that the the, uh, the up smash. Yeah. Yes. So I have to respect his choice to do that. Like he'd gone for the parry a little bit before, and he was feeling comfortable in Venya's style. Yeah. So he's like, I think I've got the read. Greninja's dash this. attack, like, is is pretty safe too. Like. If he didn't hard call it out like that, I don't think he would have been able to kill if he just punished the dash attack, like especially on shield or anything. That was actually a wonderful comeback. I hadn't even thought about it because uh, Jen definitely brought it back very cleanly at the end, but that was a comeback. He was very much behind. So now going into game three here. Uh, I, like, I like that he's moving a lot more. He's definitely like keeping his positioning ambiguous. He tries to go for the up smash. Yep. Maybe feeling himself a little bit more nice. now because the mental game is important in a patience game like this. So he gets an early lead. That's really important. Uh, Holly with a lead is super good. Yes. Uh, very difficult to come in on. Although Greninja, not the worst character in the game if you want to try to get in on somebody. I'm, see, like, he dash attack there, and, like, a lot of people would have went for the grab, but, like, Alan actually waited, and he was, he was like, no, nah, if I grab here, I'm definitely getting punished. So that was smart. Yep. And now we're at the percentage where... Um, Jen seems to be out of a lot of the kill confirms, or a lot of the traditional ones. So he's going to have to look for something different here as he continues to rack up the sun on his second stock. Kill, though. There we go. Raw fair. Yep. Stray moves will do it when you're sitting at 162. You've lived a fine life at that point. You can move on to the next. It's a weird F2 on shield. All right. He still clips him with that nair. That's pretty generous for a hitbox. Let's see, let's see how this Palatina... Notice how there too... Control. How sorry. Jen... Oh, no, sorry, sorry. I'm sorry for coming. Oh, it's all good. Um, how Venya was ready to land on Jen's shield with Nair, but he reacted and saw that it was shield and was like, no, I'm going to fade away. I don't want to get parried. I'm going to get punished for this. Like, he's still being very conscious of where he's placing his moves, even though he's throwing them out all the time. Like, he's not just going... Oh, definitely. Oh, yeah. Every, everything has a purpose. Exactly. Like, exactly. He has, he has really good spacing. Yeah. Ooh. Such a good two frame. Beam him up. On a stage like this too, like, I don't know. He has to up the more uh, in a linear way. That's actually a very smart point. I hadn't thought about that at all. Although, um... At least when he's low. Yeah. That is the confirm. That is the confirm. Sends him through the glass. Really gotta be aware of, uh... Yeah, just down tilt and there at those percents. Like, you can get hit by pretty much everything else. And very, very difficult fine. though, because if you respect that too much, then you open yourself up to grabs, open yourself up to base, things like that. Yeah. So, you know, I, I agree with what you said that where um, Jen moving around more was a big call, that made, which was really good. So now sitting at just about dead even, point two separating them right now. There, still converts off of that, even though it was uh, near the last hit. Very nice. Check chase? All right. This is absolutely, absolutely neck and neck. But I think it's going to come down to who can get advantage, I feel like. I don't feel like straight That's hits are going to yeah. That's very Very good. patient, waiting for that air dodge. Another grab. Good DI. All right. Very good. Playing with that lead. It's a small one. Be able to take it. All right. Clipsum Explosive Flame was maybe a little greedy there. It doesn't quite yep. get the ledge cancel on the platform. Yo, this music is making this anime as hell. Yeah, back air is almost <laughs> killing. Air dodge is right through Explosive Flame, too. Yep. Yeah, right. I know He's got the Venya water definitely cutter. doesn't want to get hit by this back throw. <laughs> Ooh, this water cutter oh, is the no. one! Oh my god! Oh, and he's alive. No. That's crazy. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Is that it? No! Okay, how is he getting back, though? No, no, no. Dude, he's got plot armor. Oh god. He's unstoppable. Watch out. He's got plot armor on his dash oh. No, 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 no. He's still alive. He grab. He's still alive. He's got plot armor. He cannot die. This is only act two of a three act anime. Just catches that roll back <laughs> He's so. Oh my god. Venya, the poor guy. Venya played his yeah, heart out. Not too happy there. 
He was only. I, an, I don't think anyone would be happy like with that role there. He's only an act two oh, villain. He yeah. didn't stand a chance. The poor man. He played his heart out though. That was actually very good though. Both sides. I need the breather. 